So the other day, a lady asked me about buying a computer. She was looking at a Dell and an HP, and she asked me which one is best. So I had to educate her and let her know it's not about the brand. It's about what's inside those computers. So you have to look at the specs because that's what's more important about buying a computer. It's not about HP and Dell. Yes, they might offer different perks, but you want to get the best specs for your money. So this is what you got to look for. You got to look for an i7, all right? i7 is the better processor, but if it's too rich for your blood, then you can go with an i5. Don't go with anything less than that, all right? You want to get at least 16 gigabytes of RAM. That's going to be your ideal amount of RAM that you need to keep the system flowing smooth. 8 is okay, but you're going to see some bottleneck when you start doing more stuff on that computer. Then you want to get at least one terabyte of SSD drive. Get the SSD drive versus the hard disk drive because the SSD drive is much faster. And you want to get at least one terabyte because with all the stuff we do these days as far as music and photos and stuff like that, you want to have enough space to not run out of space, if you know what I mean. Now, other things are optional, okay? So if you do a lot of gaming, then you want to get one with a graphic card that's additional Okay, not the one that's built in on the motherboard because the one on the motherboard is used for general tasks. But if you do gaming, you're going to need one with a little bit more power to make those game run smoothly. Okay, so those are the three key specs you want to look for because the processor is made by Intel, not HP or Dell. I guarantee you the RAM and the SSD, they're all made by third party manufacturer. So when you look at the perspective of it, then you realize those parts are coming from different people and then put into a box with a brand name on it. Always look for the specs and ignore, ignore, ignore the brand.